not bad. So, like I said, I think you could probably get away with three per side. And do we need one? Are you are you rolling with yeah. that? Yeah. Hey guys, John P here. So we're playing with the psych wall. We've actually got Phil here from Altman Lighting, and uh, he's awesome because you know we we have this challenge because we built this ginormous site, 25 by 25 by 12, and then we're like, oh great, how do we light this thing? So we tried using uh, LED f panels like these little not these are baby ones. We didn't use those, but we tried using big one by one panels. But the problem was they would get really hot at the top and then they die off at the bottom and you really have to have a very evenly lit wall. And so... It's kind of hard to tell on this video camera, but it, it, it's working really, really yeah, well. Yeah, so Phil, what, what is the... Br these these uh, lights that we're looking at, they have a name. What's the name of these? These are the Spectrocyc uh, 100s. Spectrocyc 100s. So they're called 100s because these are 100 watt versions, which because our wall's so tall, it, it's probably the right amount of power output. Do you have these turned on all the way full power right now? Uh, no, or, no, not really. Right now I can. Whoa. Oh, wow. So you don't so want to be awesome. staring in the front of those because they're really, really bright. But you'll notice now it's white and it's super even down here. Remember these things are on the floor, but they use a special curved kind of reflector. And so they put out a little less light down here and more up there so that it's even across all 12 feet of it. And of course these will be hanging on the ceiling. Yeah, those from will be the hanging, ceiling. They'll be hanging up on this trussing here. We'll be putting all this trussing up high and so those will be hanging from the trussing pointing downward. But I thought it was awesome too. So you've got some kind of little controller here, I guess. Yeah, this is a pocket console. It's just like a little DMX, baby a, DMX controller? It's just a little baby DMX controller. It's all it does. In fact, um, I'm in town for a trade show, and we're going to run the whole booth with these little things. Really? That's awesome. Yeah, yeah but it's pretty... <laughs> look at that. That freaks me out. That's like perfect green. That look, I swear, that looks like you could do green. The only challenge, though, I guess, would be to, to that being um, like a perfect green screen would be if when you're lighting the talent from the front, if the, there's too much light, it might tend wash to it out. wash that out a little. Yeah, I probably got to be a little careful of that. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, that's what we're up to today. Oh, yeah. We're just getting set up if you're watching on the drop cams. Yeah. Way up there. Let's see if I can it's zoom in. Nope. All right. Oops. That is really cool. Stepping on Abby. Don't tell David. 